us your name and where you're from. My name is Grant Boyer, and I'm from Richland, Washington. And Grant, can you tell the congregation the testimony that you have to share with them today, beginning with the problem that you were experiencing before you received your testimony? I was experiencing a digestive problem called mastocytic enterocolitis, and I'd been having that for a couple of years before I'd actually got diagnosed in 2009. And I partly delayed getting it diagnosed because to get it diagnosed, you had to go through a colonoscopy, which I really was definitely afraid of doing. And can you tell us what, um, describe that problem, because, you know, many of us, we don't know exactly what that is. So can you please describe for us the, the symptoms that you were facing due to that sickness? I had continual diarrhea and urgency and frequency, and literally sometimes 10, 12 times a day I'd have to go, sometimes more even than that. And when did you say that you were diagnosed with this problem? In 2009, late in the year. And so can you tell us, how did you come about receiving your healing? I actually came to an anointing water line um, at least a year or two ago. I don't remember exactly when it was now. But after I went through the line, the very next day I had a normal bowel movement, which almost never would happen when I had this condition. Probably it only happened maybe once or twice in an entire year. So I was like, wow, maybe something really did happen. But I'm not going to say anything about this for a while because I want to make sure. So um, to actually make sure, I started even eating foods that I knew were bad for me just to see how I would react. So of course, I love ice cream, but I'm allergic to milk. And I'm also allergic to bananas. So what, what's better than a, a blizzard with uh, bananas and strawberry ice cream in it from Dairy Queen? So, so I would eat things like that just to see, you know, is this really going to happen? And actually, I didn't get diarrhea from doing stuff like that, which was just incredible because even under normal circumstances, I would have expected some sort of reaction. I would sometimes get sick from it, though, like <laughs> literally feel terrible the next day, but, but I still didn't get diarrhea. So. so you mean to say that it's been an entire year now that you have not had that bowel problem? It's actually been more than a year, actually. Wow, let's put our hands together for Jesus. So Grant, now that you're here this morning and you've received this wonderful healing and you have received some normalcy back in your life and in your health, what kind of advice do you have to people who might be experiencing a sickness today? Um, don't doubt God because God is the healer. He um, you know, died on the cross and suffered his stripes for our healing. And um, even if you don't get everything you want instant instantly, he will heal you eventually. And so don't give up on that. Amen. Let's put our hands together for Jesus. Thank you so much, Grant.